everybody. It has been a while since I've been on here and I am way late bringing you this product. I have had these, um, I think since the beginning of the week and I just have not had the time to sit here and go live. I'll wait for a few people to hop on. Let me share this a couple places. I haven't even opened and tried all of these colors. So I'm just getting them, getting the uh, labels cut open right now. Hello, hello. Okay, so um, I forget when it was now. Was it last month? Month, let's see, what is, what month are we in? We're almost in June, we're in May. Okay, so April. Was it the end of March, beginning of April or something like that? Wow, we came out with a brand new, really long lasting lipstick. Um, and they were the VFX Pro Camera Ready Lipsticks. Now, when we came out with these a few months ago, um, they were limited edition. They were released in Europe and then they did a very limited supply uh, release to the United States. Well. They sold like freaking hotcakes. Um, what did we, I, I posted the stats just the other day. We sold like two, no, three million in, three million in, ah crap. What was it? Three million in, in two days or, I, I can't even remember now. If someone's watching, remembers, post it down below. I, my, my, my stats are just, anyway, we like, broke the freaking internet, broke all kinds of records and selling these um, lipsticks. And so we were begging our CEO, like, please, please bring these to the United States permanently. Like we want them, bring them here. Don't let them go away, that kind of thing, right? Well, he actually, he listened and he gave us something even better. Um, so he reformulated that product, first of all, I didn't think that that formulation could get any better. Like, I love those lipsticks so much. But he actually improved them just a bit. Um, he made them feel even lighter on the lips and last even longer. Um, so these are the VFX Elite Pro Camera Ready Matte Liquid Lipsticks. So. This box, um, you won't be able to get. I was able to order them early, so I got this special box with all of the gorgeous, beautiful, wonderful lipsticks in them. Um, but they are available now for anybody, um, and they come in these really awesome, cute uh, box sets. Um, or you can buy them individually. But the box set is really, really nice. So kind of show you here, it has eight lipsticks inside. Um, hey, Lydia. So the individual lipsticks are 19 each, but check this out. You can get all eight lipsticks in this box set for uh, 120. Again, it's not, it's not this box you'll get, it's this box. Okay, but you can get the whole set for uh, 120. So you're saving $30, $30, is that right? Yeah, yeah, $30 um, if you get the entire box. So it's pretty awesome. So what I'm gonna do is I'm, oh, thank you, Lydia. Um, if you wanna see the eye look, anyone who's watching, I just finished this up. I did it over on my Instagram stories and I shared it to my Facebook stories too. But I did not do my lips yet because I want to not try these. I've already tried them. I've had them since Monday. Um, but I want to swatch them all on my hand for you guys. And then I'm going to put something on my lips to complete or put one of them on my lips to complete my makeup look. All right. Oh, you just got yours, Kristen? Yay. So I actually just got my... Um, 
shipment of my customer orders. Um, but I've had the lipstick since Monday. I just have not gone on here and swatched them. Okay. So, starting off, now, I've not tried all the colors yet. I hadn't, I hadn't even opened all of them yet. Um, what I had put on was number 01. This is Retro Rose. This color, as far as the previous launch that we had of the VFX lipsticks, my absolute favorite color of all time. So of course, when the new formula released with the new packaging and every, everything, um, this is the one I tried first because I wanted to see exactly how it compared to my previous favorite. Like I said in the beginning of the video, um, it's lighter. So even though those were not heavy feeling on the lips, this is even, even more so lighter. Um, it feels like there's nothing on once I put it on. Super lightweight. Um, they're matte. It's a matte finish, but it does not feel thick or velvety or drying. It's not over, draw, uh, over drying in any way. Super lightweight on the lips. And I did notice um, I didn't have to apply at all throughout the day. Now, I noticed that the same with the old formula, but I could tell this stayed on even better kind of in um, the waterline. So this is Retro Rose. Again, this is just like my favorite nude lipstick um, for me personally, for my skin tone, for my preference. Um, I love the slight pinkiness of it, um, but yet it's still, it's not too overpowering. So let me, let me swatch this for you. Um, let's see. We'll go this way. I love this color. And just, just, I just did a couple little swipes that way. It, they're so opaque. Again, super lightweight. Probably drew it on a little thick, but that's okay. So this is Retro Rose. That's 01. Um, next one is Cool Beige 02. Um, we had this, uh, Cambria, these lashes are the Wow Drama, right? Yeah, Wow Drama. Uh, cool Beige was another color. Oh, I should have said that in the beginning. So when he redid the formula and brought these to the U.S., um, uh, he kept some of the old shades. He kept the most popular shades that we sold, um, but he did bring some new ones just for us. So Retro Rose, Cool Beige, and Soft Violet, which I'm going to show you in a little bit, were all brought from the old collection. The rest of these are going to be new colors. So here's that Cool Beige. This is a just kind of exactly like the name says. It's that very nude beige, but it has cool tones to it. It has a slightly pink tone, but definitely lighter than that retro rose. So you can kind of see it right here. So cool pink and, or no, cool beige, cool beige and retro rose. Uh, next one is Cool Girl. So this is a new shade. And I have not tried this one yet, but from what I've seen on other people, it is kind of that cool tone brown that we all love. I'm trying to make my swatches pretty. <laughs> so Cool Girl right here. I'm kind of thinking maybe this one with this eye look and stuff. I don't know. You guys, as we swatch, help me decide what uh, color to do on my lips to finish up. Those would be super pretty together ombre. Um, these two, they would. May or maybe, I maybe we could do that. Maybe we do like a little ombre action. Because again, this one's my favorite. And if you put that one there in the middle, ooh, yeah, that might be a good idea. Okay, Retro Rose, Cool Beige, and Cool Girl. So you can see it's it's that cool tone um, brown, not too dark, not too light, and not warm, which I freaking love. 
Okay, another new color. This one is Money Maker. Um, I did try this one on the other day, and it was just kind of that perfect nude that doesn't have, um, let me swatch it for you so you can see what I'm talking about, doesn't have a lot of pink in it. It's just more that light brown nude. So similar in tone um, with this one, but has a little bit of warmth to it and obviously a lot lighter. So that one is Money Maker. Even, yeah, uh, I was thinking that too, the, the Cool Girl and Cool Beige, those would be a good ombre. Any of these and those two together too. A lot of these would be really good uh, combo, uh, make really good combinations for sure. Okay, next 05, this is Soft Violet. So this one, um, again, was in the older collection. It was one of our more popular colors, so they brought it to this collection as well. Um, this one definitely has more pink to it. Really, really pretty though, because the pink is not overpowering. It's really subtle. Such a pretty color. Now, in the old collection, Retro Rose and this one are the ones that I wore the most. So you can see, definitely has more pink to it, um, but it's still, when it's on the lips, it is not one of those overpowering Barbie pinks. It's super, super pretty on the lips. So that's Soft Violet right there. Now this, I've been excited about super super excited it has been so pretty on other influencers that i've seen so i'm interested to try it myself and maybe that could even be a good one for tonight with my outfit i don't know um this one is flamingo pink so it's number 06 flamingo pink it is one of those more corally pinks let me swatch it for you Trying to make these pretty and a little bit thinner because I want them to try to all fit in one line here. <laughs> okay, so that right there is, oh, I love that. That is flamingo pink. So that definitely has more of a warmer coral to it, but still a super, super pretty pink right here at the end. Flamingo pink. Ah, love that. That would be so pretty on so many different skin tones. Okay, Rose Dream. This is another new one. Um, again, this is one I hadn't opened, hadn't really looked really closely at yet, so let's get it swatched. Rose Dream. So we're at, we're at 07. Ooh, this is pretty too. So this one actually kind of reminds me of retro rose but has more pinky pinkiness to it so that's gonna be super 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 pretty on okay every one that I swatch I'm like no I'm gonna wear it that one would look best I think this one would look best <laughs> every one I swatch I'm like oh let's do that one I think this one with my top and everything I don't know so that's Rose Dream 07. They're all, I know. Well, yeah, Cambria, you must have them all. We must, we must. Okay, last one is 08 Heat Wave. So this is definitely one of those, um, yeah, I think, I think so too, Cambria. I think that's gonna go good with my shirt, probably. Okay, um, Heat Wave. This is definitely one of those warm tone orangey reds. Let me get it swatched. Uh, I think I have room here in my thumb area. I don't know, might mess it up. Should I go down here or over here? 
I'm super anal because I want to take a picture after this and I like the swatches to be like pretty. <laughs> Sorry. Squirrel. Um, if I go over here, they're out of order though. We'll just do this. <gasps> oh, this is so pretty. So you can see how it has, um, I got to keep my thumb open so it doesn't squish it all together. Um, it is that warm toned, slightly orangey red right there. So let me show you them all again. So we have retro rose, uh, cool beige, cool girl, money maker, uh, soft violet, flamingo pink, rose dream, and uh, the heat wave. OMG, that would look fire on you with your warm toned skin. I'm actually a neutral skin tone, um, but yes, I am excited to try that as well. If I have like a really warm eye look, that is gonna look awesome with that. So I'm excited. Gotta watch from the beginning. I know, they're all so pretty. Now, you guys have to tell me which one to put on for tonight. This shirt, this eye look, what do we think? Here they all are. So. I knew that would happen. Literally, right before it happened, I was like, oh. You're gonna dump those out, Jo. You better stop. God dang it. Well, yeah, go ahead, laugh it up. I don't even know where all of those went. I think some are under the bed. Jesus. <laughs> okay, yeah, tell me which one to put on while you guys laugh it up, laugh it up. Uh, flamingo pink, retro rose. Okay, excuse me while I go find them all. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, maker. Okay, I'm missing two. Okay, one was under my bed. Rose Dream, Rose Dream, Cool Girl. Well, if we choose Cool Girl, um, that's the one I'm missing. Okay, I might have to get on my floor and crawl around. <laughs> Money maker, Rose Dream, Money Maker. I just ordered it right again. Oh, oh. Okay, where'd my other one go? Hold on. <laughs> All right, excuse me. I'm still here. Don't go anywhere. I'm still here. Okay, I have no idea where that other one went. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I know, my cat, my cat is down there still sniffing around. He can't find it either, apparently. <laughs> oh, that sucks, where's it at? can't wear cool girl tonight unless I find it later. So, um, what other one? <laughs> Did I go behind here? No.
know where it went. Hopefully I'm entertaining you though with my ass towards the camera crawling around my room. I have no idea. No idea. Okay. Uh, yeah, my cat probably carried it off like as soon as. Okay, yes, I will. I will raise my, okay, my hand. Here we go. And are they all dry? No, these aren't dry yet. Okay. Um, retro rose. Cool beige, right? Cool girl. Money maker. Um, soft violet, flamingo pink, rose dream, and heat wave. So let me see all my votes here. Cool girl. Can't do. I just lost it. <laughs> rose dream, rose dream, rose dream. That's three for that. Money maker. Uh, Rose Dream. Yeah, Kathy, I won't find it until like three years from now, probably, when I'm not even, when I forgot all about it. Okay, everyone's saying Rose Dream. There's like six votes for Rose Dream, so let's just do that, okay? That really drives me crazy, though. Like, it's gotta be right here. Okay. I'll stop doing this on camera and I'll just look later. That drives me crazy though. Okay, Rose Dream. Here we go. Sorry, I can't talk. I can't talk and I do this. Um. Hmm. Yeah, Cambria. I'll find it. later with a flashlight. Ooh, I like that. Ooh. They go on so creamy. So opaque, creamy, soft. And then they're they're so light. There's nothing there. All right. Yeah, I'm going to it's probably my guess is it went all the way back to the headboard and it's like right under the headboard or something it had to have just rolled all the way to the other side of the room or something <laughs> okay that is it um so once again where did where, okay let me put this back here and i have to go find the other one just to recap um, they are $19 each, um, but you can get the entire set of eight. There should be one here. I have to go find it. Um, you can get the entire set of eight for $120, so that is a $30 savings to get all the colors. And you need all the colors. I mean, look at those. Freaking gorgeous. Um, but if you buy the box set, it will not look like this. For you, it will look like this this which is still really really pretty and let me in fact I have to open one of these because um, 
some people bought individual colors and so I have to open this anyway so let me just kind of show you what the individual packaging first of all it's this really soft um, I don't even know how to explain this um, really soft it's not velvety but it's almost it is like the most luxurious cardboard I've ever felt in my life um, and then it has these rose gold details so rose gold foil wording and then right here inside the flap is these rose gold tabs and then the packaging is also a really pretty metallic rose gold. Now I won't open these um, because I will sell those, but just to kind of show you the inside, the rose gold also is on the caps. And this part here, just like that. Just so you know how everything looks. Um, and I still, I, I think I have to go back and look at my invoices and stuff, but I still have at least one of every color available. And I think I have two full box sets ready to, that can be um, shipped. Pretty sure. But you can send me a message if you're interested, and I think that's all I got. So I will talk to you guys later. Hope you have a great afternoon. Happy Memorial Day weekend, and we'll talk to you later. 